up, y'all. As you can see, I have washed my hair. And as I was conditioning my hair, I just decided to, why not make a video? But I'm making a video because I'm using this detangler. I got off Amazon. They gave me two of them. I thought I was buying one, but I got two. Like I said, I got a little hair. I was detangling. Um, like I said, I got two of them. It's kind of like that easy um, detangler that you see on um, Facebook. So, yes. So, I was trying that out on my hair. And let me see if I can sit this. My phone. Because I'm recording my phone. So... Find something to sit it up on so y'all can let me see. Hey, let me stay in the push back so maybe it'll help them. There we go. Y'all excuse me, my granny dress. Like I said, I just got out the shower. And I'm using this on my hair. So, I just washed it, and I already did this part of, this the back part. So, so now I'm doing this side. So, while I got y'all, I normally hold my hair like this. Cause I know it's real detangled. I have been working all week, so I just been wearing my hair in a puff. So I know it's pretty tangled. So. But anywho, so did y'all like hear that on um, that tea? About little fizz and Omarion. I said, oh boy, I got fired. <laughs> that was his ass get. How you gonna sit here and get with your friend, baby mama? Oh, Lord, y'all, that's a lot of love. Hell, it came out them two little sessions, but like I said, I ain't really been detangling. It came out this section and that section. And what I like about it here is easy. Just go ahead and pull out. It ain't stuck in there. But yeah. They gave, they, he got fired, y'all. That when he get, for getting with his, uh, supposed to be a friend. Because what real friend gonna do some shit like that? You know what I'm saying? But that's how that's how it be sometimes. Can't can't trust a soul in this world. I know I don't. Don't trust nobody. I could find my ponytail holder so I can. Yeah, I do my my hair is short, but I do my stuff in the bigger sections. I don't got time for it to be doing stuff in smaller sections. It's about one o'clock in the morning right now. I got my nightgown on. This is just the real as it's gonna get with me, honey. But I'm just um reviewing this. And covering up some um, hot topics. See? Yes, indeed. Uh -oh. So I kind of like that conditioning. I really do. 
like a yes. Okay, so I did that one. And let me, and I'll probably go back in with some more conditioning go and go through it. Go through it some more. So my kids go home for Thanksgiving, y'all. So I have, hope y'all have a happy holiday. It's just me and my little dog, Nina. So I know um, somebody in my comment section was asking me, you know, what's my angle of my channel, y'all, right now? I still don't know. But I am thinking about um, making some changes in my life. And... If y'all want to follow for that journey for 2020, that'll be great. That'll be great. Sometimes you got to finger comb your hair first. Finger to tangle. Y'all see like the little knots? I need to do better taking care of my hair. I really do. I really do. Sure, I'm not even sure. Let's do it. It was already some head in this pink one. I'm not even sure, but I go over there and make like see. So I put got some condition in. But anywho, so y'all, what's y'all favorite? Uh, and I, I always say mook bang, mook bangers. It says called mook bang. But I'm telling y'all. I done fell in love with the bad twins, baby. It's something else. The bad twins, be loves life. I used to watch Equal Q until she sat there and did with love like she did her. You know what I'm saying? So, I thought about with my channel doing some um, mukbangs, but not like not like every day. Y'all, as y'all can see, look at me, y'all. I'm already overweight. I don't need to be sitting over there eating a whole bunch of food, trying to make money. And then when I die from eating all that food, what good is the money going to serve me? And I ain't knocking nobody that do it. I can only, I'm only talking about myself. I can only vouch for me. I can only talk about me when it comes to that. But like I said, sometimes, you know, I don't know. But I plan on losing weight 2020, y'all. It's the holidays, so I'm going to eat what I want to eat. I'm going to eat me a good Thanksgiving meal since my kids gone. My best friend invited me over her house, so that's where I'm going to be. Y'all see, look at this shrinkage. This is just terrible. Terrible shrinkage. I got a lot of these little knots in my hair too. So put some more of this in my hair. Cause I'm gonna let it sit. I'm gonna let it sit. So y'all comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. Um, uh, support a single mother, a single mother trying to do better by her children, trying to do better in life, trying to, you know, live a good life while the Lord is still blessing me to be here, y'all. And if you haven't seen my journey from when I got sick last year, I will um, add that to the end title of what happened and, you know, 
the journey with that and how basically I almost lost my life in 2018 and um October 2018 so y'all just been a year um since I went through that so y'all can also follow me on Facebook Miss Abla and you can follow me on Instagram at Miss Abla <clears throat> Yes, I put my head to a ponytail, y'all. And as far as this brush, y'all see that, don't you? That's a lot. But I had a lot of tangles, a lot of those little tiny knots thingies. So I'm not going to, I don't think the brush pulled my hair, but that was a lot of hair. But like I said, I don't take care of my hair like I should. So this is how much hair I got, which I know y'all probably like that's a lot, but I'm not taking care of my hair. It's not like I detangle it every day because I don't. I don't detangle it every day. So I'm going to um, put some over this and let it sit. Let us see it. So I think that's what I'm going to do. But anyway. Anyway, y'all. Please join my channel. I bet y'all like me right talking about nothing. There's some stuff I do want to discuss. I ain't scared of nothing, but it's kind of like. Oh, no. Oh, no. What kind of... What what kind type of hair y'all think I got? What type of hair y'all think this is? Let me know in the comments. Let me know what type... Here y'all think I got. Anyway, y'all. Y'all uh been to eat eat with Q page. Why she trying to eat that Popeye's chicken? Knowing she wouldn't do beloved's like 20 piece uh chicken leg challenge. I hate she did that though, y'all. I used to like her. I used to like her channel. But she revealed who she really was. Look at this, y'all. Y'all see that? This is a different texture in the back of my head. Look at that. So anyway, y'all, this was just a little short review of these brushes that they clean them out. And they so easy to clean. I love that part of it. They so easy to clean. So easy. All you gotta do basically is run some water on that thing. And it's over with. It is over with honey. But anyway. So my overall review on these brushes, like I said, I got some more, I still got some more. Got some more. Got some Trying to fix it all the well. way I need to wear my stuff with it tonight. These are like those easy brushes that you see on Facebook. It's not that exact brush. It's like an imitation of that brush. So I like to use mine with these things on them. On the back. I got these off Amazon. I know I paid 
like seven bucks when I thought it only said one, but they sent me two. Um, let me know if y'all want to try to order y'all one on Amazon. And I find the exact one that I ordered. I gotta find it. it should be in my my uh, order history. But um, overall, I like it. Yes, it did. You know, take some hair out, but. I, I really think that was based on me not um, doing it with nothing with my hair for about a week and a half. I just would throw it up in my puff, rarely um, moisturize like I'm supposed to, all that. So I, I, I think that's probably the right amount of breakage that I had because I ain't been taking care of my hair like I should have been. But anyway, y'all, I'm about to finish up in here. I know y'all hear the love lights up in now on the TV, so I'm finna, um, let this sit, um, uh, put some on it, let it sit, let a little bump, let it sit, and, um, rinse it out, cause like I said, it's one o'clock in the morning, team. one o'clock in the morning, Y'all have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because I do got something coming up for 2020. Um, I think it's going to be a positive thing for um, a lot of people that may have experienced things that I have experienced in life. And, you know, sometimes it's time to make a change. Whether it's um, changing who you are, um, losing some weight, um, Getting negative people out your life. Yes, I'm gonna have a whole conversation on uh, depression, uh, the way people treat me, supposed to be family, friends, whatever. You know, it's it's sometimes it's time for me. It's time for me to love me. It's time for me to love the person that God had created, regardless of who gonna love me back. Um. Because I refuse to keep living my life in depression. I refuse to continue to let people um, make me feel a certain type of way. Um, so, and I already have been kicking folks to the curb at my life. I mean, family, I don't care. You cross me, especially if I know I ain't did nothing to you. It's over with. It's over with. Ain't nobody got time for that. I don't got time for that. When I lost my life last year... God showed me a whole lot about people, about family. And that'll let you know who really love you and who really don't. Point blank, period. I don't care what nobody say. So since then, if you riding for me, I'm riding for you. But if you ain't got, if you ain't got nothing for me, I ain't got nothing for you. Point blank, period. And there ain't no if, ands, or buts about it. That's why people stay in depression. Because they keep dealing with people that ain't don't mean them no good. And you gotta let them go. That's what I did in Beverly. I feel a whole lot better. I'm not gonna act like I don't get depressed sometimes. But not like I used to. Not like I did. I used to always wonder why people treated me the way they treated me. I used to always sit and wonder why. I mean what what was it about me, especially if I knew that I didn't really do nothing to a person for them to do me that way? Especially because I'm not perfect, but I know. I know when I know I ain't did nothing to you, I ain't got nothing for you. But like I said, and I have been living a, a happier life once I just completely leave those people alone, leave that negative energy alone. That's why I stayed in depression so long because you want to forgive people, give people another chance. And, you know, yet they still just step on and step on and step on you. So I ain't got time for it. Uh, once you show me your true colors, it's all with for you. It's all with for you. I got my kids in my life. I got a few best friends in my life that's been riding with me for years. I got co-workers. Oh, my God. I, I ain't even know the folks love me like that time. I ain't got sick like I did last year. And when I say them folk, and still to this day, let me cough. They 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 scared. Lady, you all right? You need to go to the doctor. I'm all right. But yeah, it's time, change. it's time for me to love me for who I am, for the person that God created me to be. And that basically, that's me saying, 
I don't, I don't love who I am. I don't. Because what people don't love you, I can't explain it. Maybe it come to. What people don't love you, and I'm talking about family, because a lot of people would think I'm talking about just a man. That's included. But I'm talking about people that you talk with your friend, your family members, men, all that kind of stuff. When people have treated you so low all your life, how it's hard to love yourself. It was hard for me to love myself. I, I, I can't speak for nobody but for me. It was hard for me to love myself. So guess what? I done kicked some of the negative energy to the side. So that's why I said come 2020, it's going to come some changes. That's why I said I ain't finna do no mukbang. Y'all see this weight? I'm finna get this weight up off of me after these holidays. But I, I got to eat this holiday food. But sure, that's going to happen. But yes, 2020. I'm going to love me in 2020. So y'all do stay tuned for that as well.